TikTok star Adrian Pignon to learn more about his journey. Hey, Adrian. Oh, you all dressed up. Yes, ma'am. Good morning, Tina and or Ashley. <laughs> Good morning. <laughs> all right, you're going to graduate, what, in three weeks? Sac State? Yes, ma'am. Yep. Three Which weeks. Uh, up really fast? Graduating yeah. with uh, honors, too. So I'm excited wow. about that. Congratulations. Oh, wonderful. What did you major in? Communications. Whoop, whoop. <laughs> all right, so you decided to go to all the uh, big companies with your sign that says, please interview me. Is that right? Why did you decide to do that? You know, um, that vision came to me about three years ago. And during the time I was a community college student and I said, man, I really want to work in these amazing tech companies, but I wonder how I'm going to do it. And, you know, like a vision, God gave me this idea. And here we are like a few weeks away from my uh, Sac State graduation. And I was like, okay, let's fulfill that. To, <laughs> let's fulfill that vision. So. I went to uh, the LinkedIn headquarters, the Google headquarters, Meta, a whole bunch of them, and wow. uh, it went absolutely viral on TikTok and LinkedIn, and uh, it's completely changed my life. You've been applying yeah. for jobs. How many and uh, how many no's did you get? Holy moly. So it's been over 270 job applications that have been denied. And, wow. Uh, but ever since, you know, the, the viral posts, I've been getting a lot of job interviews with amazing companies like Meta, Lenovo, uh, Snapchat. Oh, so good. It's pretty awesome. Good that for you. That is good. Great. Wonderful. So, yeah, because I think you wanted to set an example. Is that right? Yes, ma'am. Yeah. So a lot of us uh, minority or first gens or, or Latinos or, or other people that, you know, don't come from, from huge networks like they don't have the connections to go out and talk to their uncle or the dad or, or the grandpa and say, hey, can you introduce me to these people? But, you know, I started from nothing and I want to thank my parents for the opportunity to, uh, you know, allow me to pursue my dreams. And um, like, I, I just want to inspire people that, you know, if you put your mind to it and you work hard and uh, you take no for an answer that uh, eventually you'll find people that, that agree with you and, and that want to see you succeed. Wow, I love that you know this so early on. Obviously, this is the path of many people, but you are certainly a trailblazer. I can't wait to see exactly where you land. I yeah. can't wait. What do you What are you thinking? Can you give us a little hint where you might end up after you graduate? Well, I'll say this, Ashley. I want to end with, with the right company, a company that believes in me and uh, believes in my potential and wants to nurture that, but also sees that uh, I'm a scrappy kid. Like, I've got what it takes. I know social media. I know marketing. And um, just want to end with the, with the right company. What advice would you give kids who might look like you or might even have the same background uh, in terms of getting a job right out of college and catching the eye of bigger companies that, you know, maybe at some point in life they never thought they could jump into? Yeah, well, first and foremost, you have to trust God. And uh, when he tells you to do something, you got to trust him. Second, listen to your family. Uh, third, pay attention in school. And four, uh, watch Good Day Sacramento. Oh! You should see the faces we're making at each other right now. We're like, oh my God, he's so amazing. Oh, yeah. he knows what to say. You know exactly he knows exactly what to say. say. Are we hiring, Morgan? <laughs> yeah. That's, yeah, you didn't stand in front of our station and ask for a job. That's right. Jeez. <laughs> well, because you guys are an amazing team. and. Oh. Um, yeah, I'm just I'm, I'm blessed to watch you guys. I I, I watched uh, Tina when I was a lot younger, and her energy and like her vibe is just amazing. <laughs> Don't wait, make wait. her feel bad. Hold on, Adrian. hold on. Wait, is that butter? <laughs> He's buttering is you that up. Butter? He's buttering you <laughs> up. Yeah. You, you're you're incredible. Hey, I have a question for you. Who is your favorite professor at Sac State in the comms department? And I say that because I too was a comms major. <laughs> Ooh, that's a great question. Okay. Uh, Don Taylor, uh, he taught uh, Comms 150. That guy was amazing. Um, there's, uh, uh, you put me on the spot. That was, that's okay. my first one, is, is Don Taylor. Okay, and, we'll, and, we'll uh, stick with yeah, Don he, he's, Taylor. He's amazing. Okay, um, yeah. do you need us to go to your graduation or any graduation parties afterwards? <laughs> Since you're, yeah, butter us up some more. Come on. Yeah. Come on. Well, uh, okay, so for May 20, uh, the graduation is at Golden One Center, and afterwards, uh, me and my family are going to throw like a, like a festival, 
and oh, yeah. uh, not like a festival, but like a house party thing, yeah, and I, we're going to dress nicely, so I'll yeah. be sure to bombard you with emails if you want to come. <laughs> yes. There you go. Adrian Pignon, remember that name, and keep us updated, too, on your progress, okay? Yeah. Yes, ma'am. Yeah, so thank much. you so much for, for the opportunity to share my story. And, you bet. Um, yeah. Thank you. Good luck, yeah. okay? Follow him on social thank media, you. Adrian Pignon. Yes, we're going to see him by Twitter uh, for Forty-six billion dollars. It's not dollars. Tina and/or Ashley. It's Ma'am. <laughs> yeah, and thank or. you. Ma'am and/or Ash. Yeah. All right. Bye, Adrian.